with 2023's season drawing to a close. World Triathlon World Cup action move to Tongyang, South Korea, as the elite women got us going on a chilly morning. A busy throng of athletes out in the water, but it was Yuko Takahashi who was leading them around the boys on the 750 meter swim of the sprint distance event. She had plenty in hot pursuit behind her. The likes of Zanin Bragmeyer trying to stay on the Japanese athlete's tail. And there were a handful that were trying to make some early progress out on the bike. The three laps of the course taking in a steady incline for the first half of each lap. The likes of Claire, Michelle and co working hard to try and drive the pace off the front away from the chasing group. But the chasers put in a strong push. Cecilia, Santa Maria and co doing their best to reel in the leaders. And it wouldn't take long for the two groups to become one as after the three laps, a busy throng of 18 athletes came into transition two. A superb transition for Teresa Zimovyanova of the Czech Republic, putting her in a strong position out on the run. Initially, it was the American, Erika Akalan, that was leading the pace, but Takahashi quick to move herself into the top spot. Zimovyanova fighting hard, though, on the flat and holding on on the initial incline on the first lap of the five-kilometer course able to hold off the Japanese athletes' advances with Gwen Jorgensen, who had trouble in transition too, in hot pursuit and starting to close down the leading pair. Zimov Yanova and Takahashi were in a two-horse battle, but not for long as the American came storming through, once again hitting the steep incline. The American finding herself within touching distance of the leaders before striding out on the flat. A superb finish as she's always produced throughout her illustrious career and three World Cup victories in 2023 for the longtime star of the triathlon game. Takahashi finishing in second and Zimov Yanova in third. So the top three matched with Claire Michelle of Belgium coming in fourth, a spirited fight for her as she held on for a top five spot as well. But the American outlasting everybody else. Uh, you know, I feel like I had a horrible swim. I'm really disappointed with my swim today. And then, yeah, on the bike, it was a little bit of like all the way on or totally easy. And then we got to transition and I, my hands were so cold, I couldn't get on my shoes. And I just felt like it was uh, pretty crazy. So for me, I just, you know, tried to stay in the moment, tried to stay present, tried not to think about all the stuff that had happened in the past and just worked my way up. A place that she's used to standing on top spot for Gwen Jorgensen, Yuko Takahashi with the silver and Teresa Zimovyanova with the bronze.